a board certified OBGYN physician with over 30 years of experience in women's health. Today I want to talk to you about something that many of you might have experienced, a mysterious pain that occurs right in the middle of your cycle. Some of you may have felt it, like a sharp twinge on one side of your abdomen that seems to come and go without explanation. If the pain is related to ovulation, this sensation has a name, Mittelschmerz. It's a German word meaning middle pain. About 20 to 40 percent of menstruating women experience it. If you felt this pain, you're obviously not alone. The pain might actually be your body's natural fertility alarm clock. Middle schmerz may be misunderstood. Women may experience severe pain, which scares them and results in a trip to the hospital for evaluation. Since ovulation is a normal part of the menstrual cycle, the pain is unpleasant, but not abnormal. Let me break down what's actually happening, happening during middle schmerz. The mid-cycle pain is a natural phenomenon. It typically occurs about day 14 before your next period, right when your body is releasing an egg. The pain usually appears on one side of your ab lower abdomen, the same side where your ovary is releasing an egg. And here's something fascinating. It can actually switch sides from month to month following whichever ovary is active and ovulating during that cycle. Patients may observe discomfort, which can last anywhere from a few minutes to two days. Women may describe the pain as a dull ache or a sharp pain, while others might not have any symptoms at all. You might also notice light spotting, slippery cervical mucus, breast tenderness, and mild nausea. Here's the biological process behind middle schmerz. As your ovary prepares to release an egg, the growing follicle stretches the ovarian surface. When the follicle finally matures for ovulation, the egg is released with a tiny amount of clear fluid. This fluid contains prostaglandins, which can irritate the abdominal cavity, resulting in some inflammation and discomfort to some degree. That is why some women know when they ovulate. They sense the pain on one side. This entire process doesn't cause harm and usually is over within a day or so. This phenomenon is common in women 15 to 25 years of age, although it can certainly occur throughout your reproductive years. About 60% of women say they don't have any ovulation pain. For these women, that is apparently normal because they still ovulate. If you're trying to conceive, middle schmerz can actually be your ally. Think of it as your body's built-in ovulation detector. When combined with other tracking methods like basal body temperature charting and luteinizing hormone tests or ovulation predictor kits, it can help pinpoint your most fertile days with remarkable accuracy. For those experiencing discomfort, I typically rec recommend several safe management techniques. Apply heat like warm baths or a heating pad. Take medication like ibuprofen. Gentle stretching ex exercises can help and maybe relaxation techniques. However, it's helpful to know when the pain is extreme. If you experience severe pain, fever, heavy bleeding, or symptoms lasting longer than 48 hours, please seek medical attention. Middle schmerz is not the only fertility indicator, and there are other ways to track ovulation. In addition to tracking middle schmerz, you can also use beta body temperature charts to detect the temperature shift, LH surge detection kits to detect a rise in luteinizing hormone, cervical mucus observations to detect a change in mucus texture and appearance. By tracking your middle schmerz and using multiple methods, you'll be able to identify your ovulation window and increase your chances of getting pregnant. You'll also be able to monitor your reproductive health and address any potential issues. As a healthcare provider, a supportive community can have a positive influence on women's reproductive health. At Stork Advisor, we believe in empowering women to improve their reproductive health. We want to cultivate a supportive community. Moms in the Making is another organization of like-minded women who encourage others in their parenting journey. Join our Stork Advisor community today and connect with women who are passionate about fertility awareness and reproductive health. Share your experiences to help others in their fertility journey. Now let me make these suggestions to uncover your fertility potential. Keep a fertility journal to track your symptoms, temperature shifts, 
and cervical mucus changes. Use a basal body thermometer to track your temperature shift. Pay attention to your body's natural cycles and patterns. Don't be afraid to seek medical attention if you're experiencing any unusual symptoms or concerns. By following these tips and tracking your middle schmerz, you'll be well on your way to understanding your fertility and achieving your reproductive goals. Remember, fertility tracking is a journey, not a destination. If this information has been helpful, please like this video and share it with others who may benefit. At Sturk Advisor, we want to encourage women and help build healthy families. This is Dr. Stan. Thank you for joining me today.